Hello everybody, it's Ace, and today we're going to be doing, basically, t just a series on Minecraft. Um, I just loaded up a new world with the bonus chest, and I have, I think I have amplified biomes on, or large biomes, or something like that. So, basically just gonna do good. And if y'all like this series, please go down in the description right now, go hit that like button, and please click subscribe so I can continue doing more videos and having fun with all these beautiful people. Anyways... Ooh, I just thought of a good idea. Because, you know, if you go into the world creation and you do flat world, you can set one of the presets to overworld. If this video gets to 10 likes, I will continue this series, but I will also do a series playing survival on a flat Minecraft world. Alright. Okay, so. Uh, I don't really know what to get started off. Uh, I guess let's go get some trees. I'm gonna get some dark oak because, well, you know, just dark oak looks nice. Especially the doors. I love the way that the doors look. Um, and for anybody who's wondering, I am playing on Minecraft snapsh Snapshot 20W07A, which is basically the 1.16 snapshot with another update. And, well, once we get to the nether, there will be, uh... Some cool stuff to check out. Now, I've already seen what's in the nether, and it is amazing. It's I'm glad that they finally got around to making the nether update instead of just adding bees to Minecraft. Like, I still don't even know how to use bees. I've never found bees. I know what they look like, but I don't even know how to get them, how they spawn, if they just randomly spawn, or if they come from, like, a beehive. Anyways, I'm just going to finish mining the rest of this tree. And while y'all can listen to my beautiful background music, which is no copyright sound. So if this video gets copyrighted claimed, then that is stupid. And also, I am a little stuffy because I'm a little sick today, but it's fine. But I'm going to finish mining this tree and I'll get back to y'all. Okay, I don't think that there's going to be any saplings, which kind of sucks. Oh, wait, there's sticks dropping, so that must mean that they might be dropping, but... I just need one sapling. That's all I need, because I'm going to go somewhere where there's not going to be these trees, and I really like these trees. Come on. Bro. Yep, yeah, I see one. Where'd it go? Did it get stuck in the tree? Uh, oh, I see it. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, okay. Now we can go somewhere. Now, yes, technically I do have cheats on. Did I just one-shot that? Okay. Technically I do have cheats on. But, uh... I'm not really going to be getting anything out of the creative menu. The only thing I might do is, like, set a respawn. I might change the weather. I'm not going to change the time or just, like, use it to teleport somewhere. But I'm not... Dang, this cow is taking forever to kill. And I'm wasting my pickaxe. Okay. Like, I might just use locate, but I'm not going to go into other stuff and I have difficulty set on normal <laughs> and just to show y'all it ain't gonna change yeah I just locked it so therefore I can't change it ever again that's great when night comes it's gonna be a pain okay how much wool do I have uh, two wool uh, I am going to go find a place real quick Hold on. 
This is the most I'll do in the thing. That's the most I'll do and then just teleport to it. Please don't spawn in a block. Ooh, I got lucky. Okay. Okay, so this right here, it's kind of overpowered to have this here. Because you can make that into nine wheat. And you can either make it into a lot of bread. Or you can go sell, trade it with the villagers. I think one time I got like up to 13 emeralds just from trading the wheat that you get around here. Like, just watch. So you almost get a stack of wheat from that much. And you see 20 wheat. You just get that a bunch until you run out of wheat. That's three emeralds already. And I have literally just spawned in here. And if any of y'all who are curious... Y'all can see what the seed is. That is the seed. If you want to go ahead and play with me, you can. Anyways. Well, you're not really playing with me, but you'd be playing on the same world as me. So if there's anything, like, overpowered on this world, I'll show the coordinates. You can go there. And whenever it gets time to go to the end, I will show you the coordinates of the end. Respawn point. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's a lot of wheat here. That's annoying. <laughs> Sorry about that, I had to sneeze. <laughs> hmm. And there's a cave here. So, oh, there's more wheat, but that's for the horses. Is that a bee? It's a bee. Where's the bee gone? I need to see where its hive is. Move out of my way. Is it on top of the tree? Oh! Will the bee hurt you if you hit it? Or are they just peaceful? Oh god, it's mad. I made all the bees mad. I just screwed up. I need to hide. Haha, -ha, bees, you can't get me in here. I screwed up. I screwed up. I, I did something bad. I punched a bee. Now it's mad at me. I don't know why I didn't think that would happen. I'm just a little stupid sometimes. I hope they go away and leave me alone eventually. And see if they're mad anymore. Are you mad at me still? No? Okay, good. How much damage do they do? Oh, they poison you! And they slow you down! Okay, I'm sorry, B. You know, just go ahead and kill me. I already have a respawn point. Wait, do I have a respawn point? Alright, respawn point. Kill me, B. Kill me. I dare you. You won't do it. Come here, B. Eh. Come here, bees. You won't do it. Do it. Eh. Oh, that's cool. It, like, gives you a thing. Now, are they still going to be mad at me? Or are they just mad in general? There's a lot of bees over here. <sighs> They're just mad in general. Okay. Get in the house! Okay, I just learned something. If a bee's eyes are red, do not go near it. They will attack you. <sighs> Get out of my... 
This is my house now, boy. I'm not yours. No. Go. Out. My house. You know it'd be funny if the villager could get me out of his bed. Oh, I thought he did. I was confused for a second. I'm like, wait, what? Go, dude, go. Dang. Okay, let's see. Mm, I don't really know what to do. Oh, duh, we need to make a crafting table. Alright, I need to go down and get some stone, so there's coal right there. Uh, I'm just going to explore these caves real quick, see what's in here. Okay, there's a huge drop-off, but there's also iron over there, so I can get that later. Let's see what's up here. Okay, I'm gonna collect some stone. Yeah, and if uh, I do need a lot of subscribers so that you know I can get money and then actually pay for like Filmora, because right now I'm not using any editing software and this is really just raw footage. So I don't know how long this video is gonna be. I think right now we're going on 12 minutes, 12 minutes and 37 seconds. So, I might end this video at 20 minutes. I think they're not going to be over 30 minutes long. I will say that for a fact. They are not, these videos are not going to be over 30 minutes long. Unless it's like something very special happening, which probably won't happen. Anyways, if y'all, like I said earlier on in the video, if y'all like this series and you want me to continue, go down in the description, hit that like button, hit subscribe. Turn on push notifications so every time that I upload a video, YouTube will notify you. If YouTube's not being stupid, which YouTube has been doing very lately. But anyways, uh, why am I acting like I'm about to end the video? We still got like 10 minutes. Uh. And anyways, if y'all like the background music, it is uh, top 50, no copyright sounds, best of NCS, most viewed co no copyright sounds, NCS best of all time. I will leave a link to it down in the description, so if you like this music, you can go check it out. It is about three hours long, and whenever those three hours are used up, because I'm going to use the same video for some of my other videos, I'll continue to do it. And I'm probably going to upload one video of these every day, so like I said, if you like it, please hit that like and subscribe, turn on push notifications. I mean, you don't have to push no notifications, but I mean, if you don't, you won't see when I upload it, and you might you might not be the first comment, which I know a lot of people are like, oh, first comment, but I don't know. I would do it if I were you. Just saying. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go get the coal now. That is the smallest coal mine I have ever seen. Okay, bye-bye. I'll see you later. I'll see you. Okay, bye-bye. Goodbye, little buddy. I'll see you later. Okay, you'll have fun down there. Bye-bye. i just change to accents, like, mid-speech. Oh, he's burning. Don't burn before I get my sword. Aha! 
Ah, die, you chicken nugget. Yay. Oh, God, I don't have very much health left. Yay. Great. Okay, woohoo. This is a more normal, sizable coal mine. <gasps> I just thought of an idea that would technically be cheating, but technically not, because it's just a texture pack. I could get a x-ray pack. Which is actually very easy to get. You just get it and download it, and then boom. It turns everything except for ores that color. I'm not gonna do that. That's cheating. I wonder if I can turn off cheats. Because I'm probably not really going to use the cheats anymore. I just wanted to find a village to get started. And if y'all and if y'all are mad that I did that, I'm sorry. I won't do it anymore. Wow, that is actually perfect. Literally, it's perfect. Hmm, cool. This is a lot of iron here. I hear a spooter. I better go. It's actually pretty close. Why is my alarm going off? <sighs> Woo! That is the fastest I've ever ran. Okay. It's daytime. Why did the spider hurt me? I actually got a creative idea that I can do. How do I make, like, that's how you make a cobblestone wall, okay. Ta-da, chimney. Yay. How do I make a blast furnace? You know, actually, I probably want to find a bigger house to go live in. What would be a good house to live in? I say this house up here would be a good house. Yeah, this is a good house. I'm gonna live here. And there's also some goodies in the chest. Let's see. Oh! <gasps> Emeralds, apples, and spuds. We got all the spuds in the world. Spuds! Ah, okay. I'm gonna let this iron finish cooking up. I'm going to make a sword and a pickaxe and then i will end the video there because i think that's all that we have time for oh okay well that's interesting i guess it just it's gonna end a little soon uh i love how we literally basically just started and we already have iron stuff now uh well yeah Anyways, for like the third time in this video, if you like this video, please go down, hit the like and subscribe button so I can continue making more content, 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 this isn't continent, so I can continue making more content. If you like this, please just do that. It really helps me a lot. So thank you and I will see you guys later. Peace.